And now our tail of the tape for this lightweight scrap. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Amir the Prince Abaze. Ready to fight? Ready. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. All right, opens the guard, now stacked guard. Lands with the ground and pound. He's got him stacked, he's dropping big ground and pound. His opponent better move, or they're gonna stop this fight. Front kick by Lee. Oh, man. Oh, here we go. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Now he gets a more dominant position with the underhook. He is going to start to drive knees over and over. You got to be careful here. You got to move. Oh, it looks like he's got him in a crucifix now, DC. A lot of body. Oh, he's setting up for a submission now. Now he's in trouble. That Kamor looks tight. He's got a crank now, the John. He's got him in position. Now he's got to go find a finish. Oh, somehow, some way he got out. These guys are back and forth, but the submission defense wins this transition. Nice knee landed there by Lee. Trying to separate from the clinch now. Tries to work it into a takedown. Just over three minutes now to go in round one. It landed some nasty strikes. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, nice slip, and then the counter for him there. And I know DC's in the monologue is, man, can I just be the longer fighter in one UFC matchup? I get it, man. Pretty good kicks there by Lee. Another blistering combination there, really starting to do a nice job stringing the shots together. And you can see the damage in his opponent's body, his face, his body, his legs. He's beating him up on all the targets. It's not one guy just headhunting. He is finding every opening that he presented to him. Lance a good series of kicks here. All right, so we'll see what sort of defensive response ensues here. He's taking a lot of shots upstairs, and the swelling is there to prove it. Got to keep those hands up. Might want to employ a high guard to try to ensure that the guy's not landing on those spots. Because the swelling starting now, it's light. And he takes many more of these types of shots. He's gonna get real bad. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. He gets to the flying knee. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. That's a brutal cut on his nose there. He is bleeding. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. Oh, really making good use of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. Oh, well, you know about his kicks. They are on point this evening. Lee gets tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He has certainly found his range. <laughs> So another swing and a miss, and I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you got to find times to try to preserve that energy and, and get yourself back to a place where you can actually dole out some damage. Yeah, you got to get out of the space, find places to rest and recover. Get against the octagon, go to the clinch, find ways to just recover so that when you have that next explosion, it 
actually has some meaning to it. Oh, he's stepping over the head here. Oh my goodness, I think he might have it. He's got it locked in. Hang on a second. Beautiful job to escape. The level of awareness that he just showed there tells you how high level a mixed martial artist this man is. That after party's gonna be on fire. He got to his position. He found the submission, he squeezed, and got it done. It was amazing to watch, and it was amazing to be a part of the broadcast for such an amazing performance. And here we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 44 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, Due to a rear naked choke, Amir the Prince Elbaze! All right, so what a performance by this young man here tonight as he gets the win by way of submission. He certainly put a lot of stock into getting.